So today's topic we're going to discuss is um, why do I need to get pre-approved before I shop for homes? So um, the, that's the question that I get a lot from especially first-time home buyers is, uh, well, why do I need to get pre-approved before? Are we going to go ahead and find the home I need? I want to put an offer in on first, then we can get pre-approved. But here's the deal. So the reason why you do that is because certain homes qualify for certain loans, okay? So if you, let's say you want a rural development loan, which is 0% down payment, then you want to make sure that you find, you're looking for homes that are rural development qualified, okay? That's the main, that's one of the main reasons. Another reason is you want to make sure that you're shopping in the price range that you're looking for. So let's say if your your budget is 200,000, we want to make sure that we're shopping 200,000 on down below. Okay? You you don't want to go and shop 210, 215 and then you find a perfect home that's 210 and they won't go down the price to to meet your needs. Let's say if you also need um, extra money for closing costs. Closing costs can be up to six thousand dollars. You know, let's just say. Well, if you need to negotiate in the deal, closing cost, you still need to be around two thousand two hundred thousand dollars. Okay, it helps out with negotiation, and it it um, it just makes sure that you're shopping in your price range. Also, another thing you need to realize is if you're, let's say you're qualified for 200,000, but you want to set up your note for 900. Well, you need to talk with the lender to see what your interest rate will be because the interest rate, it always um, depends on your credit score. So they'll need to pull a credit score to see what your credit, credit score is in order to find out what interest rate you're qualified for. The, the better the interest rate, I'm sorry, the better the credit credit score, the lower the interest rate, so on and so forth. You also have to take in consideration, um, you'll have in your mortgage, it'll be escrowed, which means that all of the insurance, taxes, mortgage, the note, PMI, what PMI is, is it's, if you don't put 20% down, you have to put pay what is called the PMI insurance. It's a, so you have to take that in consideration. Insurance, flood insurance, that's a big one. So sometimes flood insurance can, can be up to $2,000 a, a year, okay? So you have to take that into consideration as well. So you wanna make sure that you find out all the details before you start shopping for a home. I'd love to help you. Um, I have a lot of great information on my website, listingwithted.com. It goes over the home buying process. It goes over, um, you can even, there's an application that, um, a lender application that I can send you to get started and um, on your home uh, loan application. So feel free to contact me anytime. If you have any questions, feel free to reach me at 337-945-6763. I'd love to help you out. I'd love to work with you and uh, answer any questions you may have about the home buying process. Thank you. God bless. Have a great day.